I see a lot of ads in television for Viagra, for Levitra, for Cialis. Mm -hmm. uh, these are medicines for erectile dysfunction. Is this a craze? Is there a loss of function uh, in men in their sexual prowess or activity? Mm -hmm. Well, th there are reasons, I think, why you see these ads out there. First of all, these are expensive medicines, and these companies uh, are hoping to capitalize on the uh, uh, the profit understand well there's profit out there and, and men will naturally experience some decline in sexual function over time I mean I'm not 25 anymore and I know that and when you're 75 you're not 40 anymore now that doesn't mean that you shouldn't be able to enjoy an adequate sex life there may be some compromises you need to make and some understanding that goes with that uh, reaction times may be longer for example but uh, the medicines that help with erectile dysfunction are, are when men cannot maintain an erection adequately. They can be very helpful in that, uh, in that case, any of those medicines that you mentioned. Sometimes with uh, prostate cancer, which we just mentioned, that people have radical surgery and they have problems with impotency after that surgery. Viagra medicines help there. The medicines, the Viagra medicines were first sort of discovered in treating coronary artery disease because it would dilate up those vessels. Now, if somebody has erectile dysfunction, and this is an interesting question, I don't know if there's an answer, should they have cardiovascular evaluation to make sure that that's not the cause? Well, that is a very good question, and I think underlying uh, we need to, as physicians, think about is this patient an appropriate patient for evaluation? Uh, I don't think, in my mind, that everyone who has erectile dysfunction needs a cardiac workup. Uh, cardiovascular disease increases with age. We know that. We need to suspect it and think about it in, in uh, a lot of individuals that we see in the office. Uh, there are certainly times when I will feel more comfortable in prescribing Viagra in, in, to someone who has had an evaluation beforehand because I don't want that person uh, exerting themselves sexually when they're not used to doing that and having uh, a, a manifestation of heart disease.